Welcome to the final problem in our 200 ton oceans nav problem sample exam. And uh, this is a Polaris problem and it reads on 16 July at 2000 zone time, you observe Polaris. Your DR position is latitude longitude and your sextant reads 26 degrees 57.5 minutes. Your chronometer is 05, 59, 16 and our error is one minute 28 slow. It gives a height of I and an index error for us. And what is our latitude by Polaris? Looking at the answers, we can see that they're not very close. So um, we have some room for error there, but we want to be as close as we possibly can. So as usual, I write down the preliminary information here, 16 July, our DR position. That corresponds to a zone descriptor of plus 10, 148 degrees um, west there. Our height of I and index error, our height of our sextant. Uh, so unlike problem number nine, uh, this information requires some correction and our chronometer error. So I guess the uh, first thing we can do is uh, correct our chronometer. And since that is slow, and we also see that uh, because we're in a zone descriptor of plus 10, um, we actually need to do this for 17 July. So that's when our sighting takes place. Uh, the next thing we can do is take our height of sextant, which was 26 degrees 57.5, and make some corrections to that. So first one would be index error, and that was given as uh, 1.3 off the arc. So we need to add it back on, and uh, we'll end up there with uh, 26 degrees 58.8 minutes. Next was our uh, dip or our height of eye correction, which was uh, 48 feet. So in the front of the nautical almanac, I'll pull out a value for 48 feet, which is negative 6.7. And if we do that out, we get uh, 52.1 minutes, 26 degrees. And then finally, our main correction or our altitude correction I remember we're using Polaris here and not the sun, so we just make sure we're in the right table. So I'll pull out an altitude correction there of negative 1.9. So our final um, HO is gonna be 26 degrees and uh, 50.2 minutes. All right. Uh, the next thing we need to do is get the GHA of Aries so that we can use the Polaris tables in the back. And so for that, I need to go to 16 July, or 17 July, I guess. So on the 17th of July, at a time of 0600, I'll pull out the uh, GHA of Aries right there, 2458.5. We were a little behind Aries, so um, zero minutes, 44 seconds, for Aries, we'll add 11 minutes there. So that's going to give us 25 degrees, 09.5 minutes. Um, I'm going to add 360 to that. We'll get uh, 385 degrees, 09.5. And then um, I'll subtract my longitude from that, which was 148. 35.0, end up with uh, a final LHA of 236 degrees, 34.5. So from there, uh, we go into the Polaris tables in the Nautical Almanac. And uh, in order to get our latitude, will tell us down here the latitude is our apparent altitude minus one degree plus these three corrections. So with the LHA of Aries being 236 and some change down here, I'll pull out this correction, one degree 44.3, and then one for the latitude, one for the month, uh, and then we'll have all of our corrections. So um, the formula was uh, corrected altitude minus one degree. So let's just do that first plus three corrections. So we said uh, the A0 correction was 
the A1 correction was 0 0.6 minutes and the A2 correction was 1.0 minutes. So this one came from our um, LHA varies in the Polaris tables. This one was for the latitude, uh, about 27 degrees. And this one was for the month, we were in July. So that was the correction for that. All of those corrections just came right from the Polaris tables. So I can apply them now. And I'll end up with a final value of 27 degrees, 36.1 for my latitude by Polaris. If I examine the uh, answers to the question here, you can see that uh, we ended up right where the Coast Guard did. So I'll call that one correct. So that concludes our uh, video series for the 200 ton oceans problems. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, shoot me an email if you have any questions about it and uh, happy navigating.